Well, hi, Don. Oh, yeah. I just want you to uh, picture how I'm going to be once you leave four weeks or a couple days from now. I knew this office was good for something, and I really appreciate you turning it over to me. Have yourself a good day. Don, um, what can I say? You're an old grumpy bastard. You're always complaining, you're always bitching, but uh, everybody's gonna miss it here. Uh, I hope you have a great time in North Carolina, going to all the nude beaches and all that. Um, drink a lot of beer, come to town, stop in, say hi. That's all I gotta say. Don, congratulations on your retirement. Sue, congratulations on your changing your uh, changing your job, moving to North Carolina. It's been a pleasure to get to know the two of you over the past couple of years, and, and I, I honestly say that we wouldn't be where we are today in this business without Don and your support of Don being here and, and everything else. It's been uh, it's been a pleasure to know you and wish you all the best. Don Reichert, are we going to miss you? Why? Don Reichert is a master of deception. He is crafty. He is sneaky. He is uncanny at creating trouble. Not to mention his miraculous ability to Clark Kemp-like transform himself in his office, now Randy's office, at quitting time. Don, we wish you well. This isn't like the last time you see us here. It's really been nice working with you. And this is like, remember the show, This Is Your Life? Well, this is your life at horsepower. We are going to miss you, Don, all the stuff you've been trying to accomplish and did accomplish. Even though it took you a little while and you complained a lot, we still love you, Don. It's been nice knowing you. Come back and see us again. Yeah, where's the time? Don, I will really, really miss you and all the fun that we've had. Good luck and congratulations. Hi, Don. Are you going to miss the gay? I'm sure you're going to miss the gay. We're going to miss you. So have fun in North Carolina. Try to behave yourself. Don't get too drunk and, you know, whatever. I don't know, are you going to be bored without having everything to do here? You might be. I don't know. Well, good luck, have fun, and keep in touch. Boo! Did I scare you? Well, Don, it was nice working with you. Uh, we're sure gonna miss you. Uh, well, for what work you're doing. Much, but we're gonna miss you, Don, and uh, good luck in North Carolina. And uh, keep shooting. See ya. Don, hey, uh, have a great retirement. Uh, didn't get to know you. Uh, for a very long time, but you're a great guy, and good luck in your uh, in your retirement. And uh, you and your wife have a great time. It's great getting to know you. All right, Don. Thanks again. Bye.
Well, Don, it's my turn. You know, I'm not a man of many words, uh, so I made a list of all the things that I will miss about you. John G. Douglas, partner at Horsepower Enterprises. Today is September 24th, approximately 3.52 p.m. In front of me, I have Donald Reichard's uh, employee folder, and here I have his letter of resignation in front of me. And due to your aging condition, I think this is uh, something to consider. But, unfortunately, we have a, uh, some issues here to clean up. Uh, basically, you're, you're uh, critical. Uh, your efforts and your input are invaluable. So I am sorry, John. Uh, you've been here too long. You know too much. You're, too, you're just too wonderful of an employee. So what, basically what I'm going to do to your letter, letter of resignation is stamp it denied. So with the assistance of our wonderful administrative assistant, uh, Ms. Jenny Hall, she, if, if to keep the procedure correct, if she could please slide me a stamp to stamp it denied, that would probably be, that would be appropriate. Thank you, Mrs. Hall. Approved. No, Jane. Uh, Jane, we're going to need the stamp that says denied. Uh, we don't want to approve it. That's right. Uh, please, if we have a, we probably have a secondary stamp that says vetoed. So we're just going to veto your letter of resignation. Okay. Thank you, Mrs. Hall. Once again, you're. Uh, Jenny, this stamp says, see you, see you later. Okay, no, Jenny. No, uh, there's technical difficulty here that we're having with the stamp issue, but it's just a matter of time until we get the right stamp. Uh, I'm sure we have an absolutely not uh, stamp for you, because we, you're not retiring down. I'm just sorry to wait us. Uh, thank you, Ms. Hall. If you could, that's, you know, it's so embarrassing. Uh, oh, my gosh. Hell yeah, get get out of here. No, I don't know if we could get those stamps. Uh, okay, Don. Apparently, uh, your your letter of resignation has, has been temporarily uh, approved, temporary, but just for a year. And then, we're, you know, you can do whatever you want. Get out of your system, go to venture, go. If you think you need to get out for a little bit, spread your wings, that's, that's fine with us. I mean, fuck, whatever. Uh, but we're going to expect you back promptly in about one year to continue your efforts and your work here at Horsepower Enterprise because I'm afraid this building may collapse on its own weight if you're not here to like fix the mortar and you know important stuff like that, plumbing. Uh, so uh, I know we had that issue in my office. Thank you for fixing that that one time. That was kind of embarrassing. Uh, other than that, Don, I hope you have an enjoyable one year off and make sure you return this place for employment because in all serious seriously it's a serious offer and you are absolutely welcome back here to you know work at your even if we have to adjust your hours to make you happy as a retired person seriously we hope you come back and continue working here because this place is not the same without you honestly you will be greatly missed by the employees it will absolutely be a void so uh, Sue take good care of him keep him healthy and uh, make sure he returns working here one day. Thank you, and uh, this meeting is adjourned.